And on the ballot this May, many school districts are trying to pass bond proposals to improve their campuses. In a district north of Bryan College Station, one district is trying to make this a starting point to much bigger goals for their area. KX William Johnson has the story. With elections around the corner, Iola ISD is looking to improve their campuses through extensive improvements. It's a topic the superintendent says has been months in the making. They came up with a few items that they recommended to the school board. Uh, we put those items out to Gallagher Construction and they gave us a price tag. The price of their bond is set to cost $24 million, which would increase the number of classrooms and renovate the administration building. It would also improve one of the buildings located in the heart of the school that Dyer says has led to drainage issues in the wet weather. But the superintendent says that he hopes to help the fine arts and athletics programs at their school. When they play, it disrupts nap time, so we're trying to get them in their own room. Uh, that, that's a big deal for these guys. So we would pick up an extra six classrooms in this building. The second thing we would like to have is a competition gym. The gym would account for 19 of the 24 million and the superintendent wants it to have more than one purpose for people in the area. It would not only house our volleyball and basketball games, but we want a stage where we can do our plays for one act play. We want to be able to have our concerts with our band we want to be able to have our elementary Christmas plays in, these, in this gym. So as voters cast their ballot, Dyer says he remains hopeful. It's a very exciting time. It's a very busy time for us. Uh, if it passes, it's going to be a great addition to our community. And an addition that he says will continue to prove more opportunities for students. William Johnson, KAGS News. Voters in this area have until May 7th on Election Day to cast their ballot.